Today is a snowy day. As you can see, it's snowing really hard. Normally, we have horrible visibility. Actually, today we're gonna show you where to go during low visibility, a storm day. We're gonna show you a couple of mellower tree run near Gatu area. Then we're gonna show you some of the steep run on the Cirque. The most trees in Snowbird are in Gatu. That's where we're gonna go there first. Probably the easiest tree, the flattest tree is called Black Forest. Uh, it's pretty much a half pipe. You're winding through the trees. Well, I leave behind broken crumble signs hiding all my roads to Actually, you can get some super tree skiing from entering Black Forest on the side. We're gonna show you how to. In Gatu area, the biggest tree skiing area is right next to Gazook. It's a huge tree area. You can go in from different angle. And overall, it's not that challenging. The tree's pretty tight, so it's really fun. What do you think? Coming out of Gazook Tree, you can go right back into trees via Tiger Tail Gate. Well, if you're looking for some steeper tree skiing, you can also find them in Gatu. In between the lift line under the Gatu and STH, there's a patch of trees. It's quite steep, but the tree's not very tight, so it's not necessarily skiing through the trees. Instead of skiing a steep pitch uh, along with trees, but it's still fun. two area uh, we're gonna go to Peruvian side my favorite tree skiing under Peruvian is called green room it's right next to the Dalton straw uh, it's pretty fun it's pretty steep and check it out you can always go on Cirque. There are two steep free runs on the Cirque. One is called Very, Very Steep. In order to get there, you have to traverse, which can be challenging in bad visibility. <laughs> what are you doing, Aaron? <laughs> but you get to ski down some steep pitch, uh, potentially with a lot of wind drift. If it's windy, I really like that run. First run in like two weeks. This is weird. wind drift very very steep never miss uh, on a windy day uh, because the wind drift is so good we're gonna check out Wilbur Bowl we weren't planning to ski Wilbur Bowl but if very very steep has wind drift Wilbur Bowl should have wind drift too so we're gonna check it out it should be fun because there's plenty of trees the visibility should be good too I'm looking forward to it are you yeah
was an incredible run, right? Yeah. Steep and pretty deep despite it only snow a little bit. The reason why very very steep and Wilbur Bowl as well as Wilma skiing so good on a windy day is because the wind will blow the uh, lower elevation snow upwards then when you get to the upper part the tree will stop them so there's tons of snow just got deposited there in most days if the wind is blowing the right direction it's always good another run that's very good on Cirque is called Dalton Straw uh, it's good for different reason because Dalton Straw is essentially a half pipe at, at both end of half pipe there are trees so that whole area is protected from the wind if wind is very strong, the snow would deposit there. That can be good too. Another two fantastic run that's in the tree in Snowbird, they're on the high body. One is called Venus Line. It's a very long line winding through the trees. It's a beautiful line. But if it's a very windy day and it's a low visibility day, it's probably not a good idea to go on high body. Uh, the other one is Center of Gravity. Uh, there are some trees as well. But then again, uh, if you're looking for visibility, you're looking for some cover, hiking the high body could be a tall task. <laughs>